Hi, friends. Hello. <laughs> Tonight we're making brie apple and cranberry grilled cheese. Brought to us by Recipe Girl. And we're going to put on the side Parmesan zucchini pies. I'm looking forward to those. And I'm going to butcher her name, but it is Raza Mala. Saya? Sia? Malasia? I'm sorry. Malaysia. I don't know how to say it, but it looks really good anyway. Hi, I'm Panay. I'm Paige. And I'm Paige. Welcome to a dab of crazy. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Let's get cooking. So we're going to start off with the zucchini um, because it has to bake for 20, 25 minutes. So we're gonna get that going first. Um, you wanna grab a knife and... Sure. Actually, um, you cut those up and I'll grab a knife. You can cut those up, wash those up. Flakini. That's what those are for. They're to dry off. <laughs> Things. So, if you wanna do this part, she says... Um, to do the breadcrumbs. So two cups mm -hmm. of those and a cup of, of this. Yes, on um, a plate. And then eggs Should and- Should I get the deeper plate so that it doesn't fall no. off? No. Okay. Excuse me. I'll tell you why. Whisker. Whisker. Here you go. Cool. And I kind of messed that up. What he had <gasps> I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. Am I allowed to use these to make chicken nuggets? Maybe. I'm sure we could find a recipe for um, chicken nuggets for the air fryer. Uh, using those. Okay, wait. Okay. There, wait, I need the plate. Give me the plate. This is in my way. Ooh. Oh, there goes the mouse. Oh, and the they're cucumbers. trying to fly away. So I just kind of yes. Stop actually, trying. So it's one cup of Parmesan cheese. Yes. I could put the Parmesan cheese in here. Okay. So that I could just mix it together in here and then pour it on the plate. Boom. While you're my, doing that, I'm my going genius to mind at work. Get the zucchini ready. Get in. Oh God. Okay, I have an idea. I still feel like I have pepper in my nose. <laughs> That's not gonna work. Hmm. How do I want to? Just do put that? it on the plate. That's a good idea. <coughs> oh god, that is too much. Is that too much breadcrumbs. I feel like that's too much. Take a spoon and mix it around. Actually, I'm gonna stand over here. Good idea. Oh, that's too much better. And then I put them in here. So you dip them in the eggs, and then you give them the meat. I roll them in here, and then I yes. put them in here. So I'm gonna dip them in here, get them nice and eggy. That's word that? Yep, dictionated. By who? Me. Nice. I don't wanna touch that. Yeah. Time to get dirty. Did you wash your hands? Yes. Making sure. I always wash my hands. Get them in there, good. I don't want to get the. You know what? I'll just sweep it up later. Ooh, beautiful. And then we're just gonna kind of put them in rows. Yep. Oh, oh no, the, the bread crust. <laughs> Make sure not to get too much egg on them. Cover them in egg. That's how. like cucumber. I do like cucumber, but I don't like I said cucumber. it's like, not you like. I do like cucumber, though. Well, 
Man All right, mess. let's get this mess into the in here. There's egg and breadcrumbs. Oh, the bacon. Echo, set a timer for twenty minutes. Okay, so we need to use yummy wine. Yummy. Um, if I can. I thought you didn't like white wine. I don't, but. Please don't stab me in the face. I'm attempting. Can I open it? I don't know why I want to open it so badly. Can't get it all up. Um, so my husband, one year, we went to the um, Griffith, Griffith <laughs> Observatory um, here in California, and we had brought wine, and they what? we didn't have a wine opener, so he went into the gift shop, oh. and this is what he found. <laughs> a robot. So okay. see if you can open that. I will figure it out. You push it down, and you... Twist the robot. Oh, okay. I'll figure it out eventually. Wait, how am I supposed to do this? Yeah, just like that. It's not going in. Yeah. Okay, you know what? I have an idea. So she says to... Um, it would help if I was going the right way. Maybe. Make the apple slices thin and the mandolin is great at that because it makes them all the same size. And then so I just pull the robot up. Keep twisting. Oh, oh and then it pops it up. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's why this one's so easy. To eat. Makes it super easy. Oh. When I'm older and I'm allowed to drink wine, I'm getting myself one of these. Yeah, because you aren't having mine. Duh. I don't even like wine right now. Well. It won't come out now! I'm not worried about it. Um, I am. So... Next oh, thing no. to get ready is the brie cheese. Yeah. The edges trimmed is what the thing is at. Yes. But it's going to take a minute. Oh, that's the edges. It's like it's an extra packaging around it. Kind of. Why do they add that to perfectly good soft cheese in the middle? They meant by make sure the rind is I thought maybe using like a peeler and peeling it off that way maybe I don't feel like that would be any easier mm, it looks like you're having enough trouble so yeah I don't know that anything I do is going to okay <laughs> that's as good as this is getting okay let me get this out of the oven Oof. Give me that. eyeballs Ooh. 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 So I got bacon, bacon ends, um, and I'm adding. Oh, so it doesn't have any of the fat in the between. It does, but it's not as much. It's the ends of bacon, which are always the best. Which is the crispy They're like the crispy part. parts. Mm. Um, so I had gotten and uh, bacon ends. That's what they had at the store, um, and I'm gonna put that in the brie sandwiches. Because bacon sounds amazing in this. So, mm -hmm. okay. Cranberry, apple, cheese, and bacon. Yeah. Delicious. With sourdough bread. Like the uh, whole thing, both sides? Just no, one? just one side. Because we're gonna brush the other side with wine. With wine. Eh. <gasps> I feel like since it's sourdough bread, there's this one like sauce I tried. I think it was like a vinaigrette. It was, I think it was red wine. Probably. Mm. It was a type of red wine, but it was like at a fancy restaurant. Well, fancier. There's butter on my fingers. Oh, well. And they gave us like sourdough pieces of bread. I think it was Chi-Chi's. 
Mm. Doesn't Chi Chi's give sourdough bread? Mm, I don't think there's a sourdough. They do have breadsticks though. I love their bread. No. They have bread. Buns. buns. Bread buns. Bread. Mm. It, she says brush it, but I don't feel like there's. I don't feel like it's going very well. Mm mm. Okay. Neither is spreading this butter. So. Uh, which side is supposed to be the butter side? The side you put butter on. Well, like, which side do you cook it on? The butter side. Oh. Okay, that explains my confusionness. Are you getting it now? Kind of. Not really, but okay. Usually when I make them, I put butter on both sides. And then I... It just makes it taste delicious. Cause you get oh, what does she say for the um, cranberry? Does she say like... Oh, Wambo wheat. Like two slices of bread, butter side down. Three sliced apple and cranberry sauce. Yeah, you're just basically putting it on the... In it. Use a spoon. Like jelly? Like jelly, yeah. See? Okay, I'm getting butter on my hand. You should use a spoon. Here, here's another bread. Bet, 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 bet. Buttery oh, I've just piece got of bread. Are we using this entire loaf? Yes. Sweet. Just slap that on there. Mmm. That is a lot of butter. Yes, and it's all over my hand now because... <laughs> You're welcome. Hey, I like butter. Butter and cranberry. Okay. Here you go. Put it over here. Uh, Jesus. Overflowing a bit. <coughs> Have you ever made two sandwiches in one potato maker? You can do that if you put them side to side. <sighs> and if they're small enough. What? The flat. The flat one's behind you. This one? Or the other one? The f thin one. This one. Oh, this one. This one? The what you want. Mmm. <gasps> There's a piece of hair in it. Mom, you got a piece of hair in the food. There's butter all over me. I blame the butter. Okay, we'll put this right here. That looks delicious. Oh. Oh, well, we'll put it this way. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's perfect. Huh? I'm doing math and angles over here. That's what we're learning in class today. God, I'm glad you could do math at home. I can. I don't blame you. Ooh. I had enough issues to set one on fire. What do you expect? Oh. Mm, wait. Oh, oh, they're crispy. Either that or it's just the breadcrumbs. They look delicious! Should I turn off the oven? Sure. I'm just making this bread swim in wine. Nice. Says the woman that doesn't like white wine. Baked on the things is not bad. That's true. Red wine on stuff is also really good. Especially when it's French. I've had some French food. Not a lot though. I don't remember what it was. I just remember the sourdough bread. Snails? Ew! No, I've never eaten snails. There was a kid in one of our old cult of sex that did, though. He ate all Okay, well, that's not the same as French. As escargot. Escargot. Escargot sounds exactly like barf. Or not escargot. Escargot is, um... Isn't that a car company? No, it's egg. Eggs of... 
something. Then what is snail? Snail. How do you say snail in French? I'm pretty sure that's what it is. I don't know. Ask Alexa. Echo, how do you say snail in French? Snail in French is U.S. N U.S.? <coughs> what did it say? I don't know. Hold on. Okay, I'm done with the bread anyways. I'll go check what he said. Your timer is done. There was no timer. That was the, the timer for the... Echo. What is escargot? Escargot is usually the final. A scary. Is a what? A scargo. Yeah, you're right. An edible snail. Oh, see, I was right. It is. A, it is. Mom's always right. I was gonna ah. eat it, but I'll give it to you. Mm. <laughs> That's pretty good. Uh. That is gonna be really good in the sandwiches. Mother knows best. Oh, that's delicious. Mm -hmm. I've been a mother long enough. Mm. What that I just been cooking. Actually, I guess knowing how things taste has nothing to do with being a mother. All over me. Or is this one for pie? That is a big piece of bacon. Ooh! That came from a very fat pig. Can bacon come from other animals or just pigs? I don't know. Echo. Yep. What is bacon? It's pig. It's a type of salt cured pork made from various cuts, typically the belly or less fatty parts of the back. It is eaten as a side dish, used as a central ingredient. Echo. What is bacon made from from an animal? <laughs> it's bacon. From Wikipedia, don't Echo. Bacon. Can bacon come from any other animal other than pig? According to an Alexa answers contributor. No. I will hunt in all uppercase. No! No! <laughs> with an explanation mark. Bacon comes from pigs! pigs. With it with all caps. Um, well, we're gonna finish making these sandwiches and then we will let you know how this tastes because I can tell you already the bacon is amazing. It's phenomenal. And it was definitely a good ad. Mm -hmm. So good night. Bye. with